Hello, just wanted to show a quick video on the um, Subaru Tribeca. This is a 3.0 six cylinder engine. The timing marks. I looked in old data, I looked in videos, internet, and not that many, that much information on it. At least for me, what I could find out. Um, I've worked on Subarus for many years. And this is, let me show you here. This is a Tribeca. So overheating, so overheating, did the head, we did the heads. And the timing marks is the most important. Even I have this cover on, I will tell you what we saw. Okay. So this crank here, there's the pulling inside has two marks. The arrow in all data tells you to start at 90 deg at, um, at nine o'clock, but really at the end, then it tells you to turn it, but really you have to be at a, at a, on top uh, at 12 o'clock. So always the arrow on the inside of the timing has to be pointing up. The bottom two, the bottom two sprockets on the left hand and the right hand, a, the, um, okay. These two bottom sprockets, they're not um, AVCS, they're not actuators. They're just sprockets and the keyway, you know, the little slot that it has in the middle, has to be pointing up 12 o'clock has to be pointing straight up this one and this one just like the one here so those three have to be pointing up now the top are the ones that you need to worry this is an avcs so it the cam actuates with oil depends on how much gas you're using it this is avcs too here so the older ones are not they're just regular sprockets so this one has to be 45 degrees pointing up from horizontal. And there is a dot that goes there. You cannot miss it, don't worry. If on the, on the key chain, on the chain for this, there's two chains. On the chain here, there's a little keyway that is a different color that goes with that dot. And it goes on the bottom here too that it lines up so you will match it perfectly and if that if that on top and that on the on the bottom and this keyway don't line up then that means that you don't have it correctly but it's it's not complicated it's just it seems that it is but it's not so this is 45 degrees up from horizontal okay right here this other one which is the passenger top or intake uh, right intake it's for from horizontal it's 15 degrees okay so the and you will know the same thing on this one so there is a on the chain you will see a little keyway there it will line up with another one down here but if the if if this sprocket the keyway is facing up and this one is facing up your timing marks are perfect so just to recap, let me back up so you'll know. This one, the, uh, the triangle has to be painting facing up. This one has to be 45 from horizontal up, and there's a dot that goes there. This one, the middle keyway has to be pointing up. This bottom sprocket keyway has to be paint the middle. The keyway has to be pointing up. And this one is 15 degrees. If you have any questions, um, send me a message and I'll reply. Um, I know I had, this is the second time we did this one. Um, we were working on it, we left it alone, but I know it is, um, it kind of seems complicated, but it's really not. You just you had to clear our heads and, and get it done. But just let me know if you're working on one and then I'll be glad to give you a hand. We had to do it the hard way and research, research, research and even all data 
got us a little bit confused. Anyways, good luck. Thank you. Take care.